All right, everybody, welcome back to Tomahawk Bat Reviews. We are here at Mauston uh, Woodside Ranch. Uh, today, we have a special guest, Mr. Ryan Dacko. He's gonna be giving you a little uh, information about his uh, new DNA legacy, so here we go. DNA legacy right here. Well, first off, thank you guys for having me on. Uh, this is awesome. Uh, M5 technology right here. Uh, M5 is taking over for the M2. Mm -hmm. um, M2 has been a huge platform for us. A lot of people like to swing this bat. Uh, now M5 is taking over the M2 spot. Uh, a lot of people are saying that the uh, M5 feels a little different, but I promise you guys, put swings on it, it's gonna break in, be a rocket launcher. Insert rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> so as Fabian said, we're at Woodside. It is 3.30 down the lines and it is 3.80 down the center. So we're gonna try to poke them out. We're gonna try to show uh, Daco here how to hit some bombs, all right? And then we're gonna right. do a walk-off hero at the end, of course, so stick around for that. Other than that, Daco's gonna get us started. Let's go. Let's go. Show me the ways, Daco. Show me the ways. Not the ways. Regardless of how cold it is, you can't do, like, long sleeves. At least I can't. All right, everyone, so since Daco already went over the specs in the intro of the video, we're not gonna worry about that. We're gonna change the pace and do something a little bit different and go ahead and let you guys listen to our interview with him. So hope you guys enjoy it. Let us know down below. All right, Daco, so one of the things that I love doing when doing a signature bat review is I love messaging the person who owns the bat, who designed it, who created it, the name behind it, the colorway. I just want to know what your inspiration was behind this bat. So my inspiration behind the DNA Legacy, um, well, first off, the color uh, was for my wife. Uh, she went to Georgia, so the black, red, and white. Um, second, the DNA uh, has been my signature bat all throughout Monster. Um, that always stands for the blood, sweat, tears, time that Carl and I put in at the field every single day for hours. Um, I would say probably over a hundred thousand swings um, to this point is where I'm at. Uh, probably over that um, that I've been testing bats and, and all that. So DNA is like our blood. Our blood that we've put into the company. And just the legacy of the DNA. Uh, the DNA we brought out to Corky's and that's the first time anyone had seen really a monster bat and we were super proud of it. We were like we have a winner here. And uh, we played our first game, I believe it was against T's 13. And people were like, what the heck bat is this? That bat has to be dirty, it was altered. And then after that game, we went over to test our bats for the home run derby. And there was a wave of people behind us and they put the bat into the tester and it flew way past uh, passing. And people were like, no way, we can't believe it. That bat's the best thing out, like that's it. So th that's where, you know, the DNA came from. Obviously, <laughs> thank you to Carl uh, for giving me the opportunity. Um, without Carl, none of this is possible. Uh, he's the brains behind all this stuff. I mean, he put oh, everything on the line for the company um, to even be a company. So without him, there ain't, there ain't no monster. And uh, thankful for everything that he's done for me and for the company and for uh, the world of softball. Yeah.
Ah, oh, about time. Let's go. Feel the ground shaking underneath. Try to take me alive. Baby. Oh. The walk-off hero, Dak is gonna start us off. Remember, you get one pitch and one pitch only. Let's All go. Right. All right. Does Dakko got the juice? All of a sudden, the pressure, man. The pressure comes. Ooh. Oh yeah. <laughs> Damn. Gone forever, Aaron Hernandez. All right, Fabe, come on, represent, represent. Oh, no. Oh, sabotage. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> Everybody, so we just finished up the DNA Legacy with Ryan Dacko here. <clears throat> this thing, the M5 is here, guys. The M5 is here. Um, I really like the one ounce end load, smooth through the zone. Um, I'm gonna have to give this bad boy a nine and a half out of ten. Balls are just launching out here, launching out here. Great pop, great sound, great feel. Love it. Yeah, this uh, DNA Legacy. Uh you know, is, is my bat for this year. Uh, one ounce end load. It allows me to stay smooth through the zone. 
Uh, you don't have to overpower your swing. Um, that's a huge key important part for like the way that I hit. Uh, when I try to overpower my swing, uh, that's when you get top hand, you know, you can get weird swings. So if you stay smooth, stay consistent with the zone, uh, this bat just absolutely goes to work. Uh, the M5, like I said, is going to take over the M2. Just put swings on it. Just put swings on it and this thing becomes a grenade launcher as you guys can see. Uh, and thank you all for having me out. Uh, this is yep. huge, uh, you know, being Blackfoot, my family. Yes, sir. Uh, first time on the on the show right here. Uh, <laughs> you all do a great job, and thank you for having me. How yeah, man. All right, so mm -hmm. now I'm the last person up here, and the first thing I want to talk about, you guys, is the sweet spot. The sweet spot is pretty decent on this one. It's kind of, for me, it feels like it's kind of from the D all the way kind of towards the end cap right here. Gives you a lot of range in your barrel. Definitely one of the biggest sweet spots that we've had in a while. This is my first time swinging the M5. Um, out of all year all through like the winter season. I haven't I picked them up But I haven't got the swing one um, The only problem with me you guys is I didn't get to get a lot of great performance for you guys I had a couple good swings there, but my elbow has really been hurting me I hyperextended this past weekend playing ball I was taking a guy out on two and just ran right into my elbow And so I was really uncomfortable swinging today. Um, I just had a hard time But one thing Daco and I were talking about earlier is you know, we're not always gonna be the best We're not always gonna be our best, but we're always gonna try our best for you guys You know, so I try to power through it and do my best for you guys. So anyways, this handle, it felt pretty stiff. Um, I did enjoy that because I do like a stiff handle. Um, the sweet spot, like I said, is very big. I'm gonna go ahead and give this probably a 8.7, 8.8 out of 10, okay? I really enjoyed it. I just had a hard time swinging today and that's just the performance that it gave for me. But like Fabian said, the sound sounds great when you hit it. When you get that perfect sweet spot, that swing, it feels good, that one ounce end load. With, the, with that stiff handle you're coming through mm -hmm. and like Daco said as long as you're coming through and you're controlling your swing like Don't you should be it. yeah <laughs> which I was trying to muscle it but <laughs> oh yeah I just was I was trying to get him out of here but I just had a hell of a time today trying to hit but anyways yeah 8.7 out of 10 8.8 .8 for me you guys absolutely loved it and I love the design you guys mm -hmm. it's pretty sweet yeah yeah had to do the black and red and white for my wife uh, she's graduated from Georgia so uh -huh. I had to do that one for uh, every every bat of mine the color has been picked up by one of my family members. Oh, yeah, that's pretty cool, man. So, fun fact. That. Yeah. All right, you guys, so with that, we're going to wrap it up. Had a lot of fun swinging with Daco today, man. It's awesome. Like he said, you know, he's Blackfoot. It's awesome to come out here and showcase our people, you know, even though Daco wants to beat Fabian in the home run derby. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, it was more lefty versus lefty than it was the righty, so True. I don't feel that bad. True, Fabian yeah. should. But anyways, stick around, you guys. We're going to have a vlog, and we're also a home run derby later. Thousand yes. bucks in the pot, eh? Thousand bucks. Thousand bucks. Can't wait to win that. Yes, sir. Yeah. All right. Other than that, take care of yourselves. See you take guys. care of that swing. We'll see you next time. Boom. <laughs>